I know it's been like a year. Shut up. I know it's been a year. And the video. Now you're gonna see the results. And I know I'm gonna win. Okay, guys. The votes are in. It's taken a year for us all to vote. But the winner is. Milky Way! Woohoo! I ain't being no bodyguard from Milky Way. Boy, you won't get me started and it ain't even Wednesday. It's Friday. I don't care. You, I got horns up in here and they gonna go ram up your butt if you don't be my bodyguard. I'm gonna snack that little W right off your backside. Mama, don't you be doing that. If they don't want to be your bodyguard, I guess it's going to be Miko who's going to be the president again. There's a butterfly. You don't need all that stress upon you being that president. Um, well, Miley, um, do we have to have someone else be the president now? Since uh, they don't want to be Milky Way's bodyguards. I don't think she should qualify as being president anymore. She's... Rowdy. You won't see Rowdy. Do you won't see Rowdy? I'm scared. I have a question. Why do we have a king and queen? Hand is and supposed to be raised. President. Hand is supposed to be raised. Hand is raised. Why do we have a king and queen and president? Because there needs to be a president to tell the king and queen what to do. Shouldn't it be the other way around? Well, I guess you could tell the president what to do for the people. And you just sit up in your throne, being all high and mighty. You think we're going to be sitting here in a crowd again for one more year? In 2013, in July, are we supposed to vote again? You'll be cracked. Whatever. Who's going to be the new Mik president? Miko is the president. President! I knew this day would come. It only took a year, but I got here. Take that up in your face. Your stupid milky face. Girl. Oh, Jay. What's Raise your hand to a woman. You raise your hand to a nice ghetto girl. I don't believe any of this is fair. But I don't need none of these stresses. My sister just got shot with a Glock. And now she be in the hospital for days. Now I can't go being a president if there be people in the ghetto with the Glocks out just shoot my sister. You know... I don't even know why my youngster's out in the woods. She be out in the woods. She be smoking that stuff. She be drinking that brown cow. You know what I'm saying? She be out in the woods and she be dancing. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I guess I don't need to be no president. You guys are too good. I'm going to do I'm just, I just stop that. I do go for you guys anyway. Especially you up in here with those ribbons. They'd be a lot of money at the dollar store. Thank you everyone for electing me to be president. I didn't elect you to be the president. You are not the president. I am the president. 
Now, I wanted to see a ghetto queen win. I mean, represent the ghetto all up in the presidential place. Yeah. People voted for the ghetto queen, not you, sir. Don't go kissing them babies. They'll cry. Dismissed! Okay, everyone, you can be dismissed. But everyone knows that I am the president. Yay, me! Well, I'm the captain. What if we found a different person from the ghetto to represent all up in her. Would that be acceptable? I don't know, ask him, he's the king. Um, I suppose. If you had 75% of the votes, you may. At least 75%. What's that supposed to mean? Over half. I don't but it has know to be at least seventy five percent. Like if only three people out of this people voted, you ain't got enough to be the president. Okay? Whatever. I can't believe this. Like I just jumped at this black wall. I thought it was my mama. Oh What was that racket out here? Is this a mirror? What is this? Girl, heck no, I'm a guy. What? What's this be doing up in here in the mirror? I don't know, my my tent? There's a be a penis thing. 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 I ain't moving years. Why I do that that time? What's going on here, man? Well, I just got to tell you right now. Who are you? Why you be looking like me? I don't know, but who You are can't be you? a boy and look like me and my daughter on Wednesday and Friday. I have half the nerve to just go call Big Mama. You gonna go call Big Mama? What? You gonna go call Big Mama and she gonna have to put on that silly wig and she gonna come down here and what she gonna say to you? She gonna say, I don't even know you. She know but she me, should know me and she's only my mama. me. What? Da, da, da. She a what? She's my mama. What? Big mama. What? What? Not really. What? I had my iPod in. Big mama's my mama. She ain't be no one's mama but me. And you're crazy. What's Big Mama's name? Her real name. I know I've been calling her Big Mama since I was born. Her real name is Hattie Mae Pierce. I That's thought it'd be fact. Gertrude. It'd be Hattie Mae Pierce. That's a classy woman's name. We should just call Big Mama and ask her to sort this out. No, she'd be too busy. Be too, brother. I don't even believe you. Are you behind this ball? Oh my god, did you shrink? What are you on those beanie babies? Yeah, can you read the tire? Where'd you come from? My mama, actually, it's that Yo, mama, that's a good thing. Because that's where you really came from, you know what I'm saying? Who's your dad, Ty? I don't know. I came here to meet him. She told me he's a webcam. I'm going to find who you look like most. Okay, you see here, son, there ain't much people that looks like you. You look like me, but you're a cow. You call me a fat. That is a very nice compliment to call a cow fat. Okay. You look just like him over there. His name's Bruce. Wow. Come on. What's he do for a living? He's a bodyguard. Wow, for who?
for he should be for me, but he is for this monkey over here. Hey, oh, I don't like monkeys. I like you better. <coughs> okay, Bruce, 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 what? my darling, come here. <laughs> Bruce, I have your really child creepy. right here. Come with me. I might need a bodyguard. Bruce, I have a beanie baby who Boy. thinks she's your daughter. Girl, you should sing in church. I do. I sing in the church choir. Woo! Okay. What you looking at? You, right here, you are related. He don't look like me at all. Yeah, he do. Look, you even got the white and the black. Back, white, tits. I mean, oh God, I can't go saying that on my reality show. That means others. Okay. But you do look a lot alike. Don't you think? But I don't know this kid. I ain't touching her, even though I already touched her just then. But <laughs> she is your daughter. You a girl, right? Yes. She is your daughter. Who I... is your girl? What? Who is your girl? I don't know. Where did you meet this girl? What girl? Girl. That kid over there? No, whoever her mama is. Who's your mama's name? Beatrice. Where'd you meet Beatrice too, son? Where'd you meet Beatrice too? Oh my Beatrice. God. Her. She was just like this girl I used to know. Now you're just somebody that I used to know. Well, now Beatrice says that you need to take care of your little dog, puppy, child. You need to take your... I don't know how to do that. I'm not going to ask you for help because you look like your child turned out like. I'm just socializing with Brewster. <laughs> you think we are all skags? We ain't no skags. We beautiful people like Beatrice. You must have all looked alike because she is a beautiful person, unlike yourself. Beatrice was a cat. The heck is Beatrice? Is a sure thing, girl? Beatrice. Beatrice is a cat. Damn. Beatrice is a cat. She used I, I, I don't know if she's a cat or a dog anymore. She gets plastic surgery like every week. Damn. It's like teen mom or something. Cat being to a dog being to a cat being to a dog again. What? This is crazy. She was originally a fish. Damn. Beatrice, you understand that you should be a catfish? You shouldn't be a catfish. You should be a fish and well, a cat. Well, ain't I lucky that I turned out the way I am? See, obviously that's why this is your daddy. Because if this was a fish, you would not be here like a fish. You'd be here like a fish, not like a dog. What? Now, you better be taking care of this Beatrice number two. Take care oh, of Beatrice number two. Do I feed her microwavable dinners? If that's what she wants in the ghetto, you'll be lucky to get that on Thanksgiving. So you best be feeding her top dollar of the value me and you. So now, take her Beatrice number two, because I ain't know your name, sweetie. You take her and you take care of her. Take care of her bow on her head and everything. You take her. Take her. Hey, you just dropped her. I'm going to report you to social services. Her tag says her name is Poofy. 
Her name be Poopy. What's that? Ah, what her name is Poopy? Is that like Beatrice number Poopy? No, What's that? No. Look, read the tag, girl. Read the tag. It says Top Beanie Baby. Poopy. Pretty Poopy. Poop ain't be pretty, son. I should call you Ghetto Lerona. I like that name. Ghetto Lerona. Now scratch your poopy, put on Ghetto Lerona. After my best friend, Lucretia Cab. Named after Lucretia Crampeggy Frickteggy Seagag. Named after Cake Skag. Named after Hattie Mae. Now, you'll be wondering what you gonna feed this dog. You'll be feed her pedigree. Now go and you take your daughter and you take care but of her. I'm an honest dog for life. Well, go feed her some ions or ends or whatever it be called. Go. Good. Now, this is why you turned out so good because your mama is so concerned about everyone else's business. Hey, um, I don't really know anyone around here. Can I be your guys' friends? Because we kind of look alike. We're the only little kids around here. I've been hanging out with the ghettos too long, so you don't want me to talk like this from time to time. Well, I don't know, but anyway, my name's Gunner. What's your name? My name is Bradley. That is a great name, Eyebrows. My What's name? your name? My name is Max. But you can call me Max. Okay. How on earth do I take care of you? I don't even know you. Well, my name is Ghetto LaRonda. Whatever. You and Milky Way should get married. Why? Because you make a great couple. You should marry that girl. This will be continued in the next episode.